today I will talk about black body radiation. And do you guys know any example of black body? Actually, a perfect example would be stars. Yeah. My question is, why do stars have different color? So this is what HR diagram. So this shows like luminosity, temperature, and the different colors. Yeah. So as the temperature goes higher, light blue, yeah. and then it goes to the red when it's low temperature. This is the electromagnetic spectrum. We see the visible light here, and the other sources are we can't see it. So I have some equation that based on this spectrum. So with this equation, V is frequency of light and T is the temperature. So with this Planck's law, you can find, you know, if you know the frequency of light, you can find the temperature, and vice versa. Okay, so using the black body and the diagrams and the equations for the application of it, telescopes actually use infrared detection to take pictures of stars. For today's activities, we'll try to simulate infrared imaging. So this will be your telescopes. Um, This is infrared thermometer. So what it does is that um, without contacting the sample, you can just you know, shoot it you know, and get the infrared waves in it into the sensor here. And then they just tell you the cooling temperature, right? 32 body temperature. <laughs> yeah, this is actually, let's say this is a space. You know. Space, yeah. <clears throat> and stars gonna be, I mean, yeah, ice are gonna be your stars. Okay. So what you have to do in this activity is to find the temperature of each block. These are so awesome. <laughs> Get the temperature of each block, and then just plot it. Takes time. You should take the temperature of ice first, because it melts away. Yeah. And plot it. Oh, yeah, that's, that is mine. Thank you.